Hey guys, this is Niji with HD Piano, and today we'll be learning how to play You Can't Hurry Love, so let's uh, give it a go. And that's all we'll be going through in this part of the video, but please do head over to HD Piano to see the full breakdown uh, of the entire song. So let's start with some trivia. So this was You Can't Hurry Love by The Supremes. This was the second single on one of their albums. If you know which album that this single was taken from, please leave it in the comments. Uh, and yeah, let's start there. <laughs> so, so this is in the key of B flat. And in B flat, we have a B flat and an E flat. And just for reference, my middle C is here. And this song is made up of four chords primarily. Um, the first one being B flat major, which got B flat, D, and F. Second one being your E flat major. E flat, G, B flat. Uh, third one being D minor, D, F, A. And the last one being G minor. G, B flat, D. Okay, so let's kick into it. So the first two bars starts with your left hand. I'll play it slowly. Uh, is a syncopated rhythm. It goes like this. One and two and three and four and. Yeah, I'll do that even slower. One and two and three and four and one and two and three and four. One and two and three. That very last part, we play a very quick F. It goes like this. Onto the one. And that's your first two bars. I'll play that again in time. One and two and three and four. And that very last B flat marks the start of the third bar where we play this chord, which is a uh, B flat major. So we have B flat, B flat, D, F, B flat. And then the left hand continues with this rhythm on the third bar, which is one and two and three and four. And that's one and two and three and four. And, and on top of that, the right hand plays this one and two and three and four, which is a pickup D and an F. I'll play it slowly one and two. And at that point, we start the verse, which starts uh, with a chord. In your left hand, we start with the bass notes, which are uh, syncopated rhythms. It's just on the on the beat, on the one and two and. And so for the first bar is one and two and three and four and. Just, just strictly on the B flat, no movement there. On the right hand, what we have, we start with the chord, which I mentioned earlier, which is a B flat, D, and a G. And then the right hand goes like this in this first bar. It goes like this, one and two and three and four and. I'll play that again. One and two and three and four and. So those are B flat D and G, which I mentioned earlier, and then we switch to a 
B flat and an F, and then play it in the middle. Uh, so one and two and three and four and so we hit that B flat just before and we play this chord on the four E and duh which is an E flat G and a C so I'll play that in real time just to, to get a little bit of sense one and two and at that point start of beat two start of bar two second line in we have we switch to an E flat in the left hand and it plays it for three beats one and two and then it goes back to the B flat three one and two and three and four and one and two and three and four and and so over that on our right hand if you imagine we've played that that E flat six called just before that beat one so Play that again. I'll play that again just a little slower so you can get it a little bit more easily. And then we play this rhythm in our right hand, which is so that's one and two, we and uh, which leads us into the third line. So again, we're still on the B flat in our left hand. So it goes one and two and. And that is just a D, F, D, A, D, G. So let me play that whole bar. Which leads us into the third, third line. So we start on this D minor, which I mentioned earlier. So the right, the left hand, sorry, starts with your D. So one and two. And then on that and, we switch back to the G. And two and. So one and two and three and four and. One and. We do that again. One and two and three and four and. Yeah. And then on the right hand, we have this. Imagine we've already played the, and then we play this. So one and two and three and four and one. Yeah, I play that again, but I I'll I'll spell it out. So we imagine we've played the pickup from the bar before. One and two, which is a G, B flat and an F, D. C, C, B flat. Back to that same chord again. So I'll play that together. I'll play it from the pickup. And then on this second bar in this third line, we move uh, on your left hand back to the E flat. One and two and three and four and one and two and three and four and okay uh in your left in your right hand we have we've played the and then we play this so one and two and three and four and I slow it even down. So we play a, uh, I play it from the pickup. One and two and three and four and one and two and three and four and. So we play that F and then we go to a G, which is a C, an F and a B flat. And then we go back to the G, F. So let me play that just from the end of the second line and then play the whole of the third line. So. Play that again. And 
then we're into the chorus. I'll do that one more time. And then we're into the chorus. Okay, so at the chorus, we have this. We start with our left hand, we have these, uh, we have the uh, roots again, which is your B flat. One and two and three and four and, and one and two and three and four and. So that's the first two bars in your left hand. So one and two and three and four and one and two and three and four and. And then in your right hand, we play this tune. So you can hear we love, which starts with. An F, B flat, an E flat, and it goes like this. One and two and three and four and. I'd play that even slower. One and two and three and four and. Together with both hands. One and two and three and four and. And then at this point we switch to the E flat. We've already gone through the left hand. On the right hand we have a B flat, E flat and a G. And we play this tune. So one and two and three and four E and uh, that's a pickup. So I'll play that together, both hands. One and two and three and four E and uh, and then we go to the D minor. We're on the, the third bar of this last line. One and two and three and four and. So I split that up. So in the left hand we have one and two and three and four and. I'll do it again. One and two and three and four and and then we have in our in our right hand we have one and two and four. One and two and three E and a four E and a. I play that one more time. One and two and three E and uh, four E and uh, together. One and two and three E and uh, four E and uh, and then just to end this page, we play this in our left hand. One and two and three and four and. So that's four E flats. One and two and F and octave F. And on top of that, with our right hand, we have one and two and three E and uh, four E and. Uh. Yeah. So start with the chord E flat, G, C, which we've seen before. One and two and three E and uh, four E and. Uh. So ba 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 is the timing. So put the two hands together. And that concludes the end of this page. Thank you very much, guys. Uh, I've been Niji. You can find the complete breakdown uh, of this solo piano melody arrangement of You Can't Hurry Love down at hdpiano.com. Thank you very much, guys. Thanks for tuning in. And I will see you on the other side at hdpiano.com. Take care, guys. Have a good day.